All right, this demo here is for the Branson B452R degreaser. Here is the front panel. This right here will control your coolant, your heater, your circulator pump, and your ultrasonics. This is giving your boiler some uh, temperature. Here's your EMO. And here's your start to run the PLC that will control this, make it a little bit more automated. Um, the problem is I, can, I don't have the solvent in there, so I can't uh, run the process. But as you can see, the main thing is that you do have the LED here that shows everything and tells you what to do. The only problem is that there's a vapor that needs to be done and uh, it won't, it's erroring out on me. Over here is your sub-zero to make the cool. Then you have your, your basket and your lift system here. I'm going to show you that I can manually make the lift basket go. So I'm going to right now bring it down. I'm sorry, it's going to go to the right. I can make it go down. And then I'll bring it back up. And then I'll make it go to the left. And as you can see that the, the PLC tells you which direction it's going in. All right, next I'm gonna do is I'll put on the cool, which basically you'll hear turn on the compressor and you can hear fan coming on and I'm gonna turn the heat on. Now, inside here is your coils. As you can see, the top one and the bottom one are chilled. Over here on this side, you got your nameplate, and then you have your utilities in, which it uses air, compressed air, and then it uses, uh, that's your, over here is your power in, which uses 208 three phase at 40 amps. Back here is the back of the unit. Here's where both of your compressors are. And what I'm going to show you next is the ultrasonics. I'm just going to have to uh, do a few things to get it ready. So I'm going to end the video now and my next video will show the ultrasonics working. All right, this video here is to show you the ultrasonics working and I'm going to turn them on right now and you can see that it's all bubbling in there or vibrating I have to manually go bypass this but as you can see all the uh, transducers are all working properly and it's off now as you can also see is the uh, the sump temp has risen since the last time you saw it because the heat's on. And then I'm going to turn on the circulator. And I'll go back into the same one so I couldn't turn on the ultrasonics in this together. But as you can see now the yeah, circulator's on.